Okay, we're going to look at changing the port. And first, it's worth understanding a little bit what a port is in computers. So imagine that you have a city on the ocean that has a big kind of a bay or dock or something. And we'll pretend like each one of these little things is a different port where you can land your ship. And so in a sense, your computer is kind of like this city. Your computer is this destination where, uh, you know, your web server. So in a sense, boats are coming in. Boats are coming in, and they want to land and talk to your city. In, in essence, we're saying that the uh, the Apache server, it is it it has a little thing on one of these ports, and specifically, it lives on port 80 by default, and there. There's about 65,000 different ports, and why that is, I'll explain some other time. But the point is that the default port is 80. Just to demonstrate this, suppose we go to google.com and we say google.com 80, so we're uh, a colon, and then you say the port number. You notice that it got rid of it because it doesn't even put it because that's just the default one. However, if we were to say let's go to port. 530 it's going to sit there and it's going to say that port is not open and uh, so let's go ahead and show you how to change the default port for Apache server and normally you wouldn't want to do this but it's worth understanding so I'm going to open up notepad and right click on it and we have to run this as administrator because we're going to change the configuration file so we'll go to C program files, Apache, conf, and then this HTTD conf. And go to language, change it to shell, so that way you get these nice little color things. And you can see that we're listening on port 80. So in essence, uh, we're at port 80 right now. Let's move it over so we're listening on port 530 right here, maybe. So I'm just going to change this to 530. Oh. They jumped around there. Let's go back up. Listen. Oh, so I accidentally deleted it. We'll save this to 530. And we'll save it. And you have to restart the server before it will take effect. And restart the service. Patch is restarted. So now you notice if we go to local host. It's by default, it's just trying port 80, so it's not going to see it. But let's now we're going to say localhost 530. So um, it doesn't work because Google Chrome uh, recognizes that's not a standard port and they try to protect you, so they just say it's an unsafe port, you can't use it. But if we go over to Internet Explorer, it doesn't care as much, and we go to localhost colon 530 you notice that we can now browse the internet and we're using port 530 at least our local server I don't actually want to use 530 so we'll go back and change this back to just 80 save it we'll restart the server but we're good